y'all? She was seven. Okay, so I'm sure by now y'all have seen my video. Uh, don't date broke man or something like that. Okay, so I made a bunch of memes into a video. And it was supposed to be funny. It was supposed to be satire. It was supposed to be enlightening. But I only made that video because as women, we don't have to date broke men, you know? Um, <clears throat> and what I mean by that is that's a choice. It really is a choice. It's not whatever falls in your lap. You have to take it. It's a choice. And a lot of men who don't agree with this choice it's because they are not on that level that women want to pick and choose from. You know, they are on that level where, you know, they have to make about five excuses and tell you a, a life story about why they're not supposed, to, why they're not where they're supposed to be in life. Now, if you meet a man and, they, and the first thing that comes out of their mouth are excuses about why they are not at a certain level, leave them alone because that's how it's going to be the rest of your life, okay? There's always that next big fix, that next big thing, that next investment, this, this, and that. It's always like that. So leave him, blah, 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 blah. That's the the one that never gets paid off on his investments, and he had these giant ideas, and then, then it, they never came to fruition, okay? The dreamer, okay? Um, then you have the kind of guy who, you know, <clears throat> says he owns his own business, but it's just like a, an internet business online where he has no customer base or anything and he just couldn't get a job because he probably has a criminal background okay don't go for him either y'all <sighs> so what i'm saying is women have so much more to choose from we have options we don't have to settle for a broke man now you don't have to be rich but you can't be living with your mom and you can't be dependent on somebody else you have to be able to you know have your own income your own house or apartment a car or your own transportation you can't come into a relationship with your hands out as a man okay because then it just makes you like a kid um so yeah woman want a man not a kid so if you if you're going into any relationship empty-handed nothing in your pockets um depending on someone or wanting to depend on her then just keep walking until you get your stuff together okay because you're wasting her time and you're wasting your time okay women have so much to choose from you know we can walk outside and walk around in a skimpy outfit and we will get approached you know we will we will get approached um and so it's that easy for us so of course we're going to be picky we're going to have options we're gonna say oh my god you know if I'm gonna settle down with somebody he's got to have this 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 and that because I can walk outside and have sex with any man I want basically I mean men aren't picky women are picky okay so don't get mad at women for being choosy and picky because when we do pick someone and we do choose them it's for long term we're not trying to just use them up for two seconds and throw them away like men use women no we're we're trying to find a man who's father material husband material long-term friend material lover material you know lifestyle uh material somebody that we can brag about show off to our friends be proud of our parents for bringing them home we got we got a long list y'all and we can't just pick the bottom of the barrel. I mean, if you had a choice of men, or like men, if you had a choice of women, would you go scrape the bottom bottom of the barrel or would you try to get the top where it's, everything's good and nice and ripe and fresh and, you know, shiny, you know, like an apple? Would you go to the bottom of a barrel and scrape the bottom for the bruised up, old, beat up, no good apples with probably worms and stuff in them. No. So why would you expect a woman to settle for a man like that? You shouldn't. You know, if you can't, if you don't want to get your money up or your goals up or your ambition up or your education up for a woman, get it up for yourself. You know, it, it, we shouldn't be your motivation. You should be your motivation. And then you can pick 
and choose who you want. You won't have to convince them that you're good enough because you've made all these mistakes. You don't have to come into a relationship with excuses and could have, would have, should have because you'll have your stuff together already, you know? Now, like most women, they have their stuff together or they can get it together or they can find a way to make it work without you. And they can have babies. They can still procreate. You know, they can raise families. They can do this. They can do that. But they would rather do it with a man who, you know, had some ambition and some goals about himself and who had pride in himself and had pride in, you know, being a provider for a family. They would rather do it with a man like that. But nowadays women they can't find it so they have started accepting this mediocre and it ain't right so ladies if you accept mediocre get some standards bye